So here are a few purposes of um, praying in our prayer language or our language of fire. Number one, to communicate directly to Elohim. And Corinthian Olive um, 14, verse two, it says, for he who is speaking in a tongue does not speak to men, but to Elohim. For no one understands, but in the spirit, he speaks secrets. Now, this is important because if I am speaking and I'm praying my language of fire and no one knows, not even me, but my nosy self, no one knows. I said that to be funny. I'm not nosy. No one knows. The mind is unfruitful, but my spirit is praying the perfect will of Elohim. Guess what? The enemy does not even know. This is a weapon that the ambassadors have taken for granted. The enemy is always lurking about, seeking whom he may devour, those who will allow it. And guess what? He is listening to your prayers. He's listening. But if I begin to pray in my language of fire, then nah, that joker, he can't hear it. He can hear it, but he won't understand the thing. He is not omniscient. He's not Elohim. He does, he's not all knowing. He doesn't know everything. So I am so grateful that the father has given us this perfect gift so that we can uh, pray to him and communicate to him directly and get our prayer answered every time. Mm, that's a black eye to the enemy. The Faith Kingdom Center for Ambassadors is excited to announce our prayer school. Join us every Tuesday night at 7 p.m. Central for a power-packed teaching on prayer, followed by corporate prayer. Our school will teach keys and principles of prayer that will strengthen and improve your personal prayer life. We will stream on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. If you'd like to join us for prayer school or submit a prayer request, email us at eofkcprayer at gmail.com or text us at 901-206-3220. We hope you'll join us.